Before beginning the installation, ensure the reader is configured in the Avigilon Alta Access Control System. First, create a device in the system. To access the European version, log in using the following URL. Log into the system. Here, select the appropriate namespace for your organization. To add a new device, click here. Next, click here, then here. Enter a name for the device. It is recommended to add an identifier to the name. In the Cloud Video Storage section, select a plan length. You can change your plan length. However, plans are not retroactive. For example, if you're currently on a 30-day plan and switch to a 180-day one, you'll still only have access to the past 30 days of clips. This section will populate with device details. Next, the tamper sensor is reviewed. The sensor is a basic three-axis accelerometer. When the sensor is enabled, the device will record tamper-detected events when the device is touched or moved. Adjust the sensitivity here depending on your needs or how much vibration makes it to the sensor. A higher sensitivity may produce false tamper events if, for example, a lot of vibration makes it to the video reader. Disabling the tamper sensor setting will disable tamper events. Once a device is added to the system, create a zone and entry for the reader. Consult the specific training available in the Training Center to learn more about these topics. First, click on Sites, then Entries, then Here. Note, this is where you can configure the device WiGAN port as input or output. After provisioning, return to the system to finish configuring video settings or to enable OnBIF.